Good morning, seventh and eighth period science class. Hopefully you guys um, had a good good night's sleep. Hopefully it felt good to maybe get back in the swing of things just a little bit. Thank you for those of you that completed the lab or had the materials at home that tried it. Um, it was made my day to see that you had gotten homemade compasses to work or to somewhat work. What I wanted you to observe was the fact that um, when rubbed on north and south magnetic poles, needles have a tendency to react to the Earth's north and south magnetic poles, um, uh, giving you kind of an, a glimpse as to why or how a compass works. It's the science behind it. Basically, it is. Um, anyway, today, the only thing I need you to do is to make sure that you have your vocabulary finished. Uh, I shared with you your vocabulary for magnetism for the whole unit a couple weeks ago. Some of you are finished. Some of you don't have to worry about it. What I suggest that you do is that you study those words and make sure that you know them because um, you will have a test at some point on vocabulary words. So um, make sure that you know those words. If you haven't submitted those vocabulary terms, that is your task today. Make sure I get that. It is. Um, those are going in third quarter. So if you don't have that finished, then that would be a zero in third quarter. And again, like I said, I can't motivate you from my lovely home. You're going to have to find motivation on your own or your parents are going to have to find a way to motivate you. So make sure that you get that in. And the rest of the time's yours. Have a great day. Have a great spring break. Hopefully uh, stay health, healthy and safe.